Hello everyone, thanks for joining me today. I have a design team project for artattacksupplies.com. This is the final week of Tracy's birthday bash celebration for the month of October. She is having some additional savings and on her store, all of her Halloween has been marked down 30%. And if you use the coupon code Elaine10, yes, that's 10, not five, it's 10, you will get an additional 10% off of everything in the store. Uh, her, like I said, her Halloween is at 30% off until Thursday. If you use a coupon code Elaine10, you will get uh, an additional 10% off and that will make it 40% off. So big savings this week. She is going to be having her grand prize giveaway uh, at the end of the month. Make sure you visit Chi Town Tracy here on YouTube for all the details on her giveaways. So if you purchase something in her store, you will be automatically entered into the grand prize giveaway. Okay, so here is the background uh, paper pad that I used. It is the Seaside Life. I love this paper. I don't mind cutting into my tilde paper when I use the uh, background sheets from this collection. Uh, you get 24 double-sided papers and it's easy to construct a card. You can just fold it in half. It's already pre-scored and make a six by six card or you can make a card similar to mine. You're making a gatefold easel card. Here are some of the sheets that are in the collection. I've used a few so they're not all here but I will show you my card and give you an idea of what you can make with these paper pads. This is uh, one that I used, this sheet here, for the front of my card. So I'll show you my card now. And here it is. Kept, I kept it very simple in the front. I uh, added a ribbon to keep it closed. I added the scallop shells to go with the theme of the Seaside Life. I have a cutout from the 12 by 12 paper pad, which is a Seaside Life paper pad that Tracy has in her store. And the sheet that I, I showed you, once I uh, scored it at three and nine inches, makes your gatefold. So I'll go ahead and remove the band. Put this up here so you can look at it while I do that. So let me move, remove my band. This was one of the cutouts from the 12 by 12 pad. I just added that to the front. You can stamp something on the front of this. Uh, I'll probably stamp uh, celebrate or something here on the front. And then the inside is the gatefold style. And this is what it looks like on the inside. I did use a sheet from the 12 by 12 pad and backed it here. Since it had the score line in the center, I wanted to just cover that and it really would have covered it with these uh, items that I added to the front. So that really wasn't necessary. But I added these little pieces here from the 12 by 12 pad. It comes with a little postcard and then some animal cutouts. I just cut a uh, additional piece here and I stamped a birthday greeting with another stamp here and embossed happy birthday. I carried the theme with the scallops down below and that is my project for artattacksupplies.com. I have showed you how to construct this easel card and this only takes two sheets from the background paper pad which you get 24 double-sided papers, which you don't mind using because you get so many. And here is my card once again, made with the Seaside Life background paper pad. Thanks everyone for watching and make sure you check out Tracy's store, uh, uh, artattacksupplies.com and check out Tracy's YouTube channel, which is Shytown Tracy. Thanks again everyone for watching. Take care.